Matthew chapter 17 verse 18 and Jesus rebuked the devil and it departed out of him and Jesus rebuked the devil what are those things that the devil has caused in your life what are those things that the devil have used to afflict you today I want you to know that Jesus is rising up for you and he's telling the devil get lost get lost from this family take your filthy hands off the lives of my children the Lord Jesus rebuked the devil and everything was changed in the life of that child it says and it departed out of him dear child of God I want you to know today that anywhere the devil is occupying in your life is occupying in your family today he would get lost in the mighty name of Jesus as he rebuked the devil the devil did not remain from that moment he departed the scripture says the child was cured from that very hour that is from that moment a change began to take place from that moment there was a transformation today as you are listening to this word Jesus is rebuking the devil and whatever place in your life whatever place in your family that the devil has been occupying today he is checking out in the mighty name of Jesus the works of darkness the works of the enemies the plans from the pit of hell will cease to operate will cease to remain in the mighty name of Jesus Jesus spoke those words and it happened immediately and Jesus is bringing this word to you today that today the devil is rebuked in the mighty name of Jesus the hands of the devil will be taken off your business dear child of God you seem not to understand why you did not see progress you prayed night and day but things were not going as you planned them it was because the devil had done it. This is where men slept. The enemy came. The enemies come to the time when the people of God are negligent, when they are not seen properly. And then they plant the evil seed. But today, it will be checking out whatever the devil have done, whatever the devil have initiated around your life and around your family. Jesus is arising for you. And he has spoken those words saying the devil you are rebuked take your hands off the business of my child go far away from this family because you are not welcomed here you see jesus said what my father had not planted have been uprooted today the works of darkness the works of the devil will be uprooted from your life in the mighty name of jesus yes those who the devil uses to oppose you those the devil uses to oppress your life those the devil uses to stand on your path today jesus will take them off your path today jesus will discomfort and deal with each and every one of them yes those who will come in human flesh but are used of the devil today each and every one of them will be gone away from your life because this word is coming to you at a point in time peter was taken over by the devil and jesus will rebuke that devil out of him dear child of god whoever around your vicinity around your life around your household around your life that has been taken over by the devil whoever in your family has been taken over by the devil today the word of god is coming that they are rebuked and they'll be gone he said you satan you devil i rebuke you and that moment a change began to occur in the life of peter i want you to know today that that change you seek from that one who had been afflicted from that one who had been taken over by the devil will cease to operate will cease to manifest in the mighty name of jesus because jesus is rebuking the devil and the devil will depart yes you will depart out of your business you will depart out of your life as the devil taking over your marriage yes the marriage that was filled with harmony and joy and love the marriage that was filled with love at all of a sudden become very toxic had become a problematic relationship today that devil will be checking out all you need to say to god is god 
I rebuke the works of darkness. I rebuke the devil from my marriage, from my home, from my life. As the devil taking over the lives of your children, that you do not understand their characters anymore, that they began to misbehave right before you, that the things you taught them, the things you had instilled in them have not been seen anymore. Dear child of God, you can rebuke the devil. You go to the place of prayer and say, devil, I rebuke you. Take your hands off my family. Take your hands off my household. Take your filthy hands off the lives of my family and you will see the devil will check out. Jesus rebuked the devil and it departed out of him. The scripture said that very hour, the child was cured. This very moment, this very minute, you'll be seeing a change. Whatever it is, you know that the devil has taken over in your life, in your family, in your business, in your relationships, in whatever it is. Today, that devil will be checking out. Today, it has come to the point of his expiration and the devil will leave. It will leave your business. Everything about your life will receive that renewal, will receive a restoration in the mighty name of Jesus. When Jesus rebuked the works of darkness in John chapter 4 verse 53, that very moment, the child was restored. The Bible says, so the father knew that it was at the same hour in the which Jesus said unto him, Thy son liveth, and himself believed, and his whole house knew that there was a change. Dear child of God, your entire household would know today that there is a change because God is coming through. They will see that change happening right now because Jesus, the Jesus that you have come to love and serve, is refusing that the works of darkness that the works of the enemies continue and is rebuking every single one of it in the mighty name of Jesus. In Matthew 9 verse 22, the word of God says, But Jesus turned him about, and when he saw her, he said, Daughter, be of good comfort. He said, Be of good comfort. Thy faith had made thee whole, and the woman was made whole from that hour. Dear child of God, from this hour you'll be made whole. You'll be made whole because you believe and you're comforted by the word of God. Yes, the word of God today is bringing you this comfort, saying there will be a change and everything the works of darkness have caused in your life, what the devil have caused around your family. Today, you will see a transformation in the mighty name of Jesus. It is settled. It is done because the works of darkness cannot continue. The works from the pit of hell cannot remain no more. There is no room. There is no permit for it anymore in the mighty name of Jesus. And you will see that change. Whatever it is, be it some people around you that you know that the devil have taken over. It is time that you rebuke the works of darkness, the works of the devil, and it will check out. In the mighty name of Jesus, you will see that change you have been praying for. In the mighty name of Jesus, you will see that transformation you have been seeking from God. In the mighty name of Jesus, because the devil is rebuked. The works of darkness is going to cease right now. In Luke 10 verse 19, it says, Behold, I give you authority. I give you power to tread upon snakes and scorpions. And nothing shall by any means hurt you. He says, I've given you that power to tread upon the works of darkness. I've given you powers to tread upon everything that the devil is using to militate against you. Today, you have the power. You have the authority. And it's in your words. It's in the words of your command. If you say to the devil, this very moment, I rebuke you. Leave my home. Leave my family. He must check out every of his works with his cohort will check out. He says, if you say to this mountain, be that removed and be cast into the sea and you believe and you're not doubting, it will happen as you have said it. So if you say to the devil, leave my family, leave my business, leave my life. I need to enjoy my life. I need to get my blessings. I need to get all the things that God have destined for me to receive. I want to assure you you will begin to get them because the works of the devil, the works of darkness will cease from this moment 
in the mighty name of Jesus. There will be a change. There will be a transformation in Jesus' mighty name. God is settling you and you would have a reason to rejoice. I call it done because it is settled and the works of darkness ceases to operate and manifest from this moment in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. You would have a reason to rejoice. You would have a reason to testify because God has done it in Jesus' name. Amen. It is well with you, beloved. God bless you and shalom.